Intrigue, Spite, Vengeance. Yes, it's the 81st Golden Globe Award, starring Taylor Swift. Wait, where the hell'd she go? It must be quite unfamiliar to her to not win everything. It's a new award at the Golden Globe. Cinematic and box office achievement. Taylor's Eras Tour was up for it, but the award went to, you know, Barbie. Watch me. Taylor stood, she applauded while thinking, you shall all pay for this insolence. And viewers were quick to notice. Taylor left pretty shortly afterwards. Well, Taylor led the standing ovation for Barbie winning that award. Passive aggressive. Yes. Passive aggressive. Yeah. Would Taylor Swift have stayed had she won? Absolutely. If this is just box office, it's all predetermined and she shouldn't have been It is not because it's the achievement. What does that mean? No one knows, but we do know this. Sources close to Taylor say she really didn't leave as early as it's being reported. She went to the bath where she had to use the restroom. She actually didn't leave until 15 minutes before the award show completely ended. Well then where was she? Hanging out in the bath. We're still in the restroom. Might have been a really big dump, like huge, like an hour long session that brings tears to your eyes. In any event. It didn't start out great for her. Joe Coy fired a shot at her. I don't think this is a shot. No, Joe Coy was comparing the NFL to the Golden Globes and said, On the Golden Globes, we have fewer camera shots of Taylor Swift. I swear, there's just more to go to here. Hey, say what you will about his monologue, that's a good freaking joke. She wasn't mad, I think she was just taking a drink. It was so very hard to watch. The whole thing was very hard to watch. God, I'm sure glad I went to bed at seven. It was on at five. Oh, right. Are you <laughs> yeah. Sorry you didn't win, Taylor. Maybe one of these days, you'll catch a break.